It's time for market art. It's March, 2021, and our project is beautiful butterflies. In your kit, you are going to have an instruction sheet. There are four coffee filters, four assorted washable markers, and two pipe cleaners. This will make you two total butterflies. So we are gonna start with one butterfly. So you're gonna take two of your coffee filters and just draw. You don't wanna fill everything in. I like to do something that kind of radiates from the center. Your colors are picked specifically so that they don't get muddy. If you were to do colors opposite on the color wheel, so red is opposite of green, blue is opposite of orange, and yellow is opposite of purple. If you do those colors next to each other, when they bleed together, once you get everything wet, it would actually make kind of a muddy brown. So your colors should all look good next to each other, no matter what order you put them in. <clears throat> your shapes don't have to be precise. You're really just gonna see the color more than anything. So we're just gonna kind of fill this in. Notice I'm not really being careful. And I have two coffee filters, one on top of the other, so that we have a very similar look with the two coffee filters. That way the butterfly, the top and bottom of the butterfly are gonna match. And you can do as much or as little as you want, but you definitely wanna keep some white space because the white space is going to be where the color bleeds and they kind of mix together and give that really pretty spring look. One of the best tips I can give you is to cover your workspace before you wet your coffee filter. So I'm gonna use just a baking sheet for mine. Um, you could use newspaper or something if you wanted to, but baking sheets are really easy. And I'm actually gonna spray with a water bottle. I've also done this where you just use a, a small measuring spoon or something and drip the water and let it bleed. You can see it's already starting to stretch that color out. We're gonna let it stretch. Once it's all saturated, you just wanna let it sit. You don't wanna add extra water or it'll take a really long time to dry. If it's a beautiful day outside, you can set this out in the sun and it could be dry in as quick as a half an hour or an hour. It might have to wait overnight if it's uh, drying inside. All right, our coffee filters are dry. So once they are dry, you're gonna pull the two apart and you're gonna have two really similar looking coffee filters. So we're gonna take the first one. This is the brighter side. Um, so I just want to make sure when I'm putting my butterfly together that this is the side that shows. But you're going to start just folding it in a fan or accordion fold about half an inch up. So fold it this way, flip it, fold it again. And then do the exact same thing to the next filter. Make sure that your folds are about the same size. All right, so once both of your coffee filters are folded, you're just gonna stack one on top of the other. You're gonna find the center or near center and then use your pipe cleaner. Set it in the middle. And this is going to be the body and the antenna. Once you like where it is, twist it around a couple times so that it stays in place. You can trim the antenna if you don't want them quite so long. I don't mind the long. And kind of curl it 
I just wrap it around a finger, thumb. There you go. And then we're gonna spread out each side of the coffee filter into top and bottom wings. We've been working on these projects. These are all over my house now. I've had my, my helpers make some. Get it so it's just the way you want it. You can spread it out more, fold it up more, however you like. So there is a completed butterfly. And this one has some friends. You've got enough to do another one. Thanks for joining us again. If you like what we're doing, you like creating art with us, please consider a tax deductible donation to help fund these free art activities. You can donate at www.jffa.org slash donate, or you can donate to PayPal. It's paypal.me slash J-F-F-A-P-A. Thanks, guys.